In 2007, the United States produced 254 million tons of garbage. The average American throws away nearly 7 pounds of trash on a daily basis. About only 20% of Americans recycle. That means 80% of Americans throw away recyclable items in everyday life. If everyone recycled, not only would the world look a lot different, but the recycling industry could add billions of dollars to the global economy. What you see going on right now is this pile of waste we've been building up for six days. If everyone in the world stopped recycling, we would be up to our ears in garbage in no time. Waste disposal has become a huge problem in many parts of the world, especially here in America, where we produce practically more garbage than anywhere else. We interviewed Mrs. Rickert, the advisor of the Go Green Club. Do you recycle? And if so, what do you recycle? Of course I recycle. Why would you not recycle? Um, let's see, at my house, I recycle aluminum cans, tin cans, plastic bottles, plastic containers if they take them, newspaper, did I say tin cans? Yeah. Everything in cardboard. All right. According to a survey taken by Austin High School students, 93% of students recycle, while 7% do not. Out of those who recycle, 76% recycle paper and cardboard, 63% recycle glass, and 76% recycle cans. So, how can we encourage people in Austin to recycle? Well, students at Austin suggest we make billboards, posters, learn about it at a young age in school, add recycling bins around Austin, and put it in commercials like in the news. What do you think we as students can do to get more people to recycle? First, start doing it yourselves. Tell teachers they should recycle and use two-sided on their papers. Um, lead by example and tell kids, hey, there should be recyclable rooms, recyclable containers for paper in every classroom and for cans and aluminum in the halls and in every classroom. So lead by example and do it and convince kids that it's a good thing. And take your caps off because it saves money. If everyone in America recycled just one plastic bottle, those materials could make more than 54 million t-shirts. If everyone recycled one can, it would take 6,750 passenger cars off the road and save energy equivalent to 80,000 barrels of oil. Recycling can benefit you immediately also. In Apple's latest environmental responsibility report, the company recovered an estimated 40 million in gold from devices. In this video, the Apple company is showing us how they recycle each part of their iPhones. The Coca-Cola company is trying to make all their products recyclable. This is how they do it. That's a good question. Depends on the year, honestly. It depends on the year. It depends on who is there. This year, we've been focusing on recycling here. We are also the ones who are pushing for the water fountains, the filtered ones with your bottles. So um, we were pushing for that. Um, this year, we're going to be, we go to the Capitol um, April 10th for Water Day. That's about how to work with legislators to do things. Um, Earth Week, Earth Day, we go to the elementary schools to talk about how to get this promoted. And this year we're expanding in and talking to the city and park and rec on how to recycle in the parks. If you would like to help donate to the cause, please visit RecyclingForCharities.com or donate to your local recycling center. <laughs>